Well, I'm pleased to welcome Jane Giambroni, a clinical diabetes educator with Rochester Regional Health, back to the program. It's good to see you again, Jane. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. So as you know, we have sort of an, an ongoing conversation about nutrition, uh, especially this time of year. And this morning, I want to focus in with you uh, about uh, uh, nutrition as it relates to diabetes, uh, whether it's pre-diabetes or uh, type 1 or type 2, wherever someone falls on the spectrum, nutrition obviously is a key component of trying to have a healthy lifestyle, isn't it? Absolutely. And one of the first questions I always get is, I have diabetes, what do I eat? Mm -hmm. That is the very common question. And it's not a special diet, it's basically healthy eating, having your nutrients. And so what that means is making sure you have your fruit, your vegetables, and I recommend a heart healthy diet, uh, having nuts, raw nuts at least once a day, uh, cutting down on meat and sugars. And did you know, Mark, that 74% of all processed food has sugar in it? And we talk about losing weight as well as an important component of yes, this. Yes. And not just controlling blood sugar, correct. but making sure we're eating healthy foods, right? Yes, that is correct. And eating healthy foods is one thing. and by eating healthy, weight loss will come. Mm -hmm. So what I do recommend is doing simple things. If, for example, you drink soda every, every single day, regular soda, to cut back on the soda, to have soda maybe um, every other day, or to eliminate it completely if you could get to that point. There are other action steps people can take as well uh, and working your way up to really addressing the underlying issue. Yep, um, you mentioned about weight loss. Losing weight is very important. It doesn't have to be, some people think, oh my gosh, I have 50 pounds to lose, 75, 100 pounds. It's really not about losing a lot of weight. Even if a person is to lose 10 to 15 pounds, studies have shown that has helped. So instead of being overwhelmed with, oh my gosh, I have diabetes, what am I supposed to do? It's taking things step by step and small changes really do make a big difference. And if people want to go one step further, there's a phone number you yes. would recommend they call. Yes. To yeah. let somebody connect with them, understand their situation, and then get them hooked up with the right program. Yes, thank you. Diabetes is important to have support, and we do have support. At um, Rochester Regional Health, there's a number that can be called. It's 585-368-4560, and uh, when you call that number, you can schedule an appointment with a registered dietitian one-to-one. -one. We also have classes. We have plant-based cooking classes, uh, living well with diabetes series, and we also have pre-diabetes classes. Great. Uh, we will leave it there. Our time is short. But as always, we thank you for coming in and sharing thank you, your Mark. insight on this all-important topic of nutrition. Thanks, Jane. Thank you. So uh, you heard that phone number. Uh, if you missed it, any of our conversation, as always, we're sharing it online. You'll find it posted at rochesterfirst.com.